Hi everyone. Welcome to this short presentation on the differences between a hub, a bridge and a switch. A hub broadcasts an entire network frame to all its ports. This broadcast is done by repeating the electrical signals of the incoming packet. Therefore, hub is really known as a repeater. A hub operates at layer 1 of the OSI model. This is because the destination MAC address is immaterial and the packets are sent to all the hosts on the hub. Since the hub ensures that every port gets the network packet, it is one of the easiest devices to create a network. Here is a picture that represents the network hub. You can see that a packet goes in from one of the ports and it gets replicated inside a hub and is sent to all other ports on the hub. So what is a bridge? The traditional definition of a bridge is that it connects two LAN segments. So a bridge usually has two ports. A bridge is also a more intelligent form of a hub. A bridge operates at layer 2 of the OSI model because it relies on the MAC address to forward a packet. A bridge is not a practical device for end hosts, so it is usually connected to hubs. A packet reaches a bridge on one of its ports and the bridge then checks whether the destination MAC address is can be reached via the other port. If yes, the packet is sent via the other port. So what is a switch? A switch is a bridge with more than two port. It operates at this uh, on the same principle as that of a bridge. A switch overcomes the limitations of hub as well as a bridge. Since the switch filters packets based on MAC address, it can manage the traffic better than a hub. And since a switch has lot more ports than a bridge, it can be practically connected to many end user devices or hosts. Here is a picture of a switch. A packet enters the switch from one of the ports which is connected to a host. The switch then checks which port has the destination MAC address and forwards the packet to that port. This concludes a very high level overview of the differences between a hub, a bridge and a switch. If you liked what you saw, please share the link. Please click on the like it button on YouTube. And if you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them in the YouTube comment box and I will respond to you. Thank you.